The first reviews for Halloween Kills are coming out from Venice, but is it good or is it bad? Coming to get you, Barbara. This is a pretty early video, so there will be more reviews coming out even after this video gets uploaded, but the first initial reviews that I've read so far have been excellent. There's people saying it's a gore fest, some people are saying it's amazing, there's another guy saying that he feels really sad and he felt emotional for one specific character in the movie. I've no idea who that is and I don't really want to know either, but the initial reviews are looking pretty good. They're actually looking a lot better than the 2018 Halloween movie. That got, I think it got a standing ovation, I'm not too sure, but it got a lot of really good reviews. But this one, judging just from what I read so far, is getting even better reviews. That doesn't mean it's gonna be a better movie. It might just be initial reactions where people are really on cloud nine when they first watch a movie, especially at a, a festival like Venice. And then they come away from it and think, do you know what? I did say it was great, but I'm actually thinking it's just good now. And I do that myself sometimes when I go and see a movie in the cinema. So it doesn't mean it's going to be amazing. It just means that the first initial reactions are great. And if that's anything to go by, even if I don't love the movie, when I go and see it for the first time, I might love it. And then I might really like it later. That's the way I gauge it anyway. Now, I do have one of my insiders. Uh, he did actually see the movie a few months ago. Uh, he's not a Halloween fan, so I can't really gauge on how I would think, but he did say, and this is the first time I'm saying this, he did say that it was really good, and if you're a fan of the Halloween movies, you're going to love Halloween Kills because it ups the ante on absolutely everything. Um, so I already knew that I was going to love it anyway, regardless of if anyone else liked it or not. I knew that I was going to love it from what he told me because he knows me and I know him, and he knows how to gauge how I would know or how I would like a movie. So I was already excited for that, but just reading these comments, just off the bat so far, I'm really excited. Again, I'm going to read more um, as they come through. In fact, while I'm here just now, I'll just refresh to see if there's any more out there. Um, no, there's not, but that's fine. It's absolutely fine. There's a, there was a panel, I think it's still going on just now with Jamie Lee Curtis, and she's talking at the panel talking about her fears etc and obviously her involvement in the Halloween franchise. I'll probably give that a watch later on because I hear, again I don't know if this is confirmed but I hear she's kind of bashing H2O a little bit again. I love H2O and she didn't bash it when it first came out so please stop doing that Jamie Lee because I know you personally love H2O like I do. Anyway guys, that's all for just now. I'll probably do more updates with regards to the reviews. I don't want to read too much into them because I don't want any spoilers obviously. I just wanted to gauge some people's thoughts as soon as they came out of seeing Halloween Kills at the premiere. Uh, but leave your thoughts and comments down below. Again, any spoilers will have to be deleted because I've had to delete a lot lately. So spoilers will be deleted. Not only will, will they be deleted, you'll unfortunately be banned from the channel. I've had to ban lots of people from the channel recently. Even people who are innocent about it, they just leave spoilers for some reason. So I have to delete it and ban them and that's what I have to do. So leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think of the, the reactions so far. And as always guys, I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.